Last week I got a message from a homeless man. His life hadn't turned out the way he planned it to turn out, and that if it weren't for Oz Harvest, he would be starving. And he sent me a message saying that a homeless man says thank you. Before I started Oz Harvest, I saw so much food go to waste. I knew that there were people in need, and I wanted to make a difference. I remember being a young chef, and uh, the lady I worked with, she just berated me. It's like, why are you throwing the stalks of the broccoli away? And she sliced them, she crumbed them, and served them on an antipasto platter. And that's when it started dawning on me, you know, that there's so much wastage that goes into the bin, and it doesn't need to. Oz Harvest to me is not just about people wasting food, it's about feeding people, making people happy. That's what life's all about. I want to give up my time for us harvest because I want to give back to the community in which I lived. Logistically, the process is quite complex. We're moving food from hundreds of different locations to hundreds of charities. We're trying to get to all our donors on time to provide a decent meal. We have a lot of young men that come in here with brain injury, heroin and ice addictions. So we try and get these boys back on the road to recovery. Oz Harvest provide a great opportunity for young men to get back on their feet. The saving that they pass on to us, we reallocate those funds into things like rehabilitation. They're essentially bringing balance and nutrition back into the lives of these boys. I got into alcohol a lot. I was socially very inept and so that would give me a lot of confidence to talk to people. I couldn't stop. The police caught me drink driving, which led me to go to the program. That's when you understand that you've got a life to live. When the boys come in off the streets, they are sick, and so the food does have a positive effect to get back to the healthy lifestyle and the generosity of Oz Harvest. It's the reason why I'm still here. They save people's lives. One of the most touching moments I've had was when a woman came up to me and she said, I want to thank you. I didn't have any food and my son was going to school behaving badly and from the time that we started getting food from you, everything changed and my son has just gone to university. Food is about sharing, food is about caring, food is about dignity. Every single time we throw away a banana with a freckle or an apple with a bruise, it is costing us the earth.